The prayer that I'm going to share with you today was written by a good friend of mine, James Dillett Freeman. He was a friend for many years, and actually he performed my wedding, for those of you familiar with him. He wrote a free man's prayer. I'm going to modify this slightly uh, to bring it up to date to a free human's prayer to include both men and women. In 2 Corinthians, it says, Where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. Well, we pray today. Almighty God, lift up my heart and lift up my mind that I may serve you. Give me the courage in this moment to do the things that come to me to do. Keep me from downheartedness. And God, I pray that you'll give me the wisdom and the joy to keep the hearts of those lifted around me. Give me, dear God, the willingness to share in the common responsibilities. To you, my dear God, I entrust my life, my country, and my ideals. I am but trying to fulfill your will the best that I know how in this moment. I work not to destroy, but to preserve the good. The victory with which I try to serve is the victory for all humanity. Let me, dear God, not fail in my faith, in the dignity of the human spirit. Let me not falter in the vision of a nobler, kinder, way of life. Let not the love of freedom ever fade from my heart. Lord, lead me on to the tasks that lie ahead of me, to the labor of uniting all of the different areas of my life with your love we pray that we can be a part of the peace that is not founded on force, but on the mutual respect of free humans everywhere. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray. Amen.